Jay Poole here from Buckeye Marine. I'm really excited to share with you our all new line, Nautic Star. Uh, we're the very first dealers here in Canada to have Nautic Star. And, uh, I'm going to walk you through our 2102 Legacy here. So starting at the back, uh, we're pretty excited. Nautic Star is exclusively powered by Yamaha Outboards. They're clean, reliable, uh, ultra quiet. Uh, very efficient motors, they're great power blend and we're really excited to have them. This one's got an optional ski pylon here so we can tow tubes, tow other boats in off the water, uh, water skiing, wakeboarding, you name it. Climb board, we'll see some stuff on here. So starting at the helm, uh, we've got this you know, really nice open helm area. Uh, a lean post that you can also sit on. Uh, it's a really nice, comfortable driving position, especially in rougher water. You can either uh, you can stand here, lean up against it, be really supported, or you can get up, sit in it, uh, have a nice high view. You can see all the way around you. We've got Yamaha gauges. Uh, Yamaha throttle. You got a really great stainless steel cockpit here. You know, all of the Nautic Star boats have uh, hydraulic assist steering. Um, this one is equipped with a 7 inch uh, Simrad touchscreen and you've got all of your accessory switches that are stainless steel, uh, really sort of robust switches and the nice thing about the Nautic Star line is these same stainless steel switches are on through the whole line so all the way up to their 28 and down to their 18 so you've got you know, these really good robust switches and uh, stainless steel hardware throughout the boat. Uh, booted. Uh, breakers right there, easy access, easy to work on, and then you can see they've gone to lots of detail where we've got uh, stainless steel hardware on everything, so no plastic that's going to break. You got these stainless steel locking uh, hardware on a lot of things here. Simrad is really awesome right now. We've got it in demo mode. It's really uh, got great reflexivity. It works really quickly. Um, the touch is, is ultra sensitive. It works great. Really visible in, in bright lights and situations. We've also got this one with the blacked out um, seat posts and the blacked out T top. The T top is an awesome option. We've got black bottom, white top. There's an option for the color on the bottom. We've done black here. Um, above there, we got spreader lights and down facing lighting. Uh, really help you to see at night, but also give you a nice sun and a nice durable hard top with fishing rod storage in the back of the seat and the top of the, uh, of the T top. Let's move forward into it, into the bow here. Moving forward into the bow, um, one of the nice things about the Legacy and the, and the Nautic Star line is even in this 21, um, we're really, really beamy. It's a really wide boat. So we've got lots of walk-through space, you know, shorter gunnel, gunnel walls are easy to get over, non-skid on the top so when you're getting in and out of the boat you've got really good, uh, good traction. Um, one of the things I really like about the Nautic Star line is even though it is a fishing uh, center console line, they've got great bow seating. So uh, this one's got the filler cushion in it, we can take it out and we've got sort of bow rider style seating. Um, you can take that seating out and you've got non-skin underneath but if you're going to do some pleasure boating you want to have that sort of bow rider effect um, the legacy line has that which you know, gives you a really good opportunity to sort of seat and do some social boating we've got a forward facing seat ahead of the console and inside that you've got a, a big live well so you can uh, put your catch in there all of these live wells are insulated so you can double them as coolers if you need to one of the nice things, they've got these recessed bow rails, um, so when you're walking along the deck, they're not up in your way, you're not going to trip over them, but at the same time, anytime you're walking, you've always got something to grab onto in rough water. If you're a passenger, you know, it's, there's always a rail within reach, everything's nice and solid in the boat. Put a nice anchor locker right up in the bow. Fixed anchor inside there, protocast lockers, and cleats wherever you need them. Come around the other side here. We've got a really nice big 
cabin. Now, it is typically an option to put a head in there. This one we haven't put the head option in. We got nice big storage. Um, it's well lit. Uh, they've got a nice waterproof LED light in there. Um, the, if you were to put a head in there, uh, there's lots of room in, lots of room for it. But if you don't do the head, it's just a really nice big storage space. Underneath the driver's seat, you've got this great storage compartment. You know, it's just a small catch, but you can, there's lots of things that you can think of that you can put in there. Lines, uh, anything that you kind of need to, that's loose and you need to have stowed. Below that, we've got a really big Marine Legends igloo cooler. There is an option for a Yeti. We've opted for the standard cooler on this guy, but you know, you want to throw a big Yeti in there, that's definitely something we can take care of. Along the back here, we've got all sorts of seating. That's one of the nice things about the Legacy. You've got that standard, you know, really comfortable social seating. But, you know, if you're going to be out fishing or it's a rainy day, you can pull all this off. You've got non-skid underneath. Really heavy duty stainless steel latches. And then these are friction hinges so that no matter where they are, they'll stay where you've got them set. You got a bait bucket in here. Just another live well under the other side here. And in the center, we've got a nice big clear top bait well that also has a that's also lit. This boat also has a, a raw water shower and a raw water wash down. So anytime you get anything wet or dirty, you can just hook your hose in, spray the whole boat down. I'm really excited about this Maddox Stern line. There's no wood in the construction. They're built really, really well. Um, very durable. They're going to be a great boat for the Cortez and the Ontario market. We're really excited. Right now we're at the Cottage Life Show. These boats are going to be in the water starting about next week. And uh, we're excited to take you out and see what these Nautic Stars can do.